So I'm going to break with tradition here and uh, after this short intro of the uh, plastic intake valve which you can see in my hand here, the white stem going down in the engine, um, I'll now have the uh, short uh, run of the engine followed by uh, showing the valve and how I uh, made it etc. So here's the plastic valve bridge. Throw in some mustard go juice here. There's no guarantees this one's going to run, but we'll give it a try. Am I surprised? It actually decided to run. Who knows? It could have melted the valve in that amount of time. Give it one more try here. leaking out the intake valve back through the carburetor anyway a, yep, can't get it to zoom back any so that was the first test of my glass head there so this time I'm going to try out a plastic intake valve I had to cover the top of it with the JB weld uh, just because the plastic was too thin, but uh, that's what I'm going to be running in the engine. I was going to try a uh, another plastic piston, but uh, this one's just uh, rough cast at the moment here. I still have to uh, drill out the piston pin and sand it down to size and all those fun things. So, but like I say, our hero this time will be the plastic intake valve. And I'm going to be using this uh, real light duty spring that I've made for it here. Um, it's going to be an automatic intake valve. In other words, it's not opened by the camshaft. It's uh, just opened by, uh, open and closed by airflow. So, uh, and it's going to be on my uh, slow speed engine. So it won't be revving as high as normal to try to prolong the life of the, the uh, plastic valve. Well, things are looking up. I got compression now. Just wanted to show you here what it sounds like. Sounds like a reed valve there. Anyway, that's that plastic intake valve making that noise there, so. So as short as that run was, I'd have to call it a success for uh, the plastic intake valve. At least the concept worked at all. As well as the first test of my plexiglass head here. Exhaust valve opening there. At least nothing blew up. So, next I'll try a uh, wooden piston with the plexiglass head.